Hey guys, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you how to install the Zans minimap mod for Minecraft 1.8. Now, uh, as I said in my last video, this is one of the few mods that has actually updated to 1.8. Um, but yeah, um, so basically what you want to do to install it is visit the description and under downloads there will be two links. You want to click them both. Uh, the first one is going to take you to the mod itself and then the next one is going to take you to light loader which is basically like a uh, forge but sort of different um, so yeah what you want to do here uh, is just scroll to the bottom until you see downloads and uh, you want to look for 1.8 and then you want to click download from server 1 so click that that's going to take you here you just want to click download and uh, once you've done that you can close these two tabs and then onto the light loader, you just want to scroll to the bottom again until you see 4 Windows EXE. So click download from server 1. Once you've done that, uh, you want to click show all downloads here. So just click that. And then now you've done that, it'll show you the two files you just downloaded. So basically all you're going to do is get this uh, light mod, Zans minimap. Just drag that to your desktop and uh, drag the other file to your desktop as well. So now you have these two files. You can close this, and now what you want to do here first is install Light Loader like you would with Forge. So just double click on it, and uh, then you want to click Install Light Loader, and uh, then you want to click this 1.8, and uh, then you can also name it here. So I would recommend doing that. Um, so this is it's going to create a new profile with Light Loader, and um, it's also going to have your mod. So what you want to do is just name it like Mod. Or, um, you know, Zans. Just, I don't know, it doesn't really matter. I'm just going to name it Minimap Mod uh, with a capital M, of course. Um, so, yeah, uh, once you've done that, just press OK and uh, that's going to install Light Loader. So, once it's done, it's going to say complete. So, just press OK and uh, now you've installed Light Loader. Uh, that was pretty easy. So, you can just delete that. And uh, now all you have to do is install this. So uh, what you want to do is press the Windows key and R at the same time, and that's going to bring up this run thing. Basically, in here, you just want to type percentage, app data percentage. So once you've typed that in, just press OK. Once you've done that, it's going to bring you to your roaming folder, and you just want to look for .minecraft, should be at the very top. So go into that. Then you want to go into... Actually, you might not have this. But uh, if you have a mods folder, just go into that. If you don't, just right click in this open space here, right click, new folder, and call it mods, M O D S, just like that. Then press enter, then go into that. And now all you have to do is get this Zans Minimap mod, mod, Zans Minimap mod uh, file. So just select it and then just drag it into here. So now in your .minecraft, you should have a mods folder, and in that you should have Zans Minimap mod. So once you have that. And you have installed Light Loader. Uh, all you have to do now is open up Minecraft. And uh, then when you click this arrow here to view your profiles, as you might usually do, um, here you have one profile which is just, uh, you know, Minecraft 1.8, so just the normal version. And then the other one, which we you named, is called Minimap Mod for me. It might be different for you. Um, but select that, and that runs this, which is basically just the mod. So to play with the mod, you just select this profile and press play. Okay, so once it's done, uh, it should come up with that thing at the beginning. That's how you know it's working. So uh, if you just create a world, as you can see in the top right, I can't point to it, but uh, you can press Z, that'll come up. Um, yeah, bit, uh, okay. So yeah, uh, as you can see in the top right, there is a mini map. If the achievement goes away, yep. Yeah, so yeah, uh, you can also press M for some extra options and stuff. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, if it didn't work for any reason, just leave a comment and uh, I'll try to get back to you. And uh, yeah, if you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you all later.